So welcome to BCFE Virtual Open Day. My name is Kenneth Ray, Deputy Principal of BCFE. Viewing our Virtual Open Day today is best viewed by minimizing the video on the right hand side or by choosing side by side view under viewing options at the top of your screen. For over 40 years, Ballyferma College of Further Education here in the heart of Dublin has helped give students an advantage in a wide range of industries, from social care and tourism management to the modern creative arts. Have you ever wondered what goes into making your favourite video games? Or your favourite animation? Are you more interested in TV and film production? Maybe you want to be immersed in a world of visual effects and 3D animation. The course in Ballyferma College of Further Education could be the start of your journey. Contact the college today or visit the website for a full list of courses. Ballyferma College is looking forward to creating a future with you. BCFE, Ballyfermot College of Further Education, is widely recognised as being one of Ireland's leading providers in the delivery of further and higher education and training. Remember, students can apply directly on our website, bcfe.ie, on the upper right-hand side of the page. Places are limited on courses, so apply now. BCFE caters for students from the age of 17 and upwards and offers over 45 courses across the following departments, animation and games art and design, business and tourism, digital media and games, education and learning, media, music, childcare, social care and healthcare, television, film and visual effects. We have a wide variety of further education and training programs which are fully accredited and offer an opportunity for students to gain valuable experience for progression or straight into employment. We welcome applications from all prospective students, from students completing the Leaving Cert or including LCVP, LCA or equivalent A-levels GCSEs to mature learners returning to education. Again, remember, you can see it on the screen there on the right hand side and the website you can apply directly to BCFE during this open day on the upper right hand side by clicking apply and you just add some details and you can apply to one of our courses. Places are limited. Now we have a range of courses, so throughout the open day we will be introducing you to course departments and giving you a flavour of the courses we offer. Ballyferma College of Further Education is a national leader in new course development and it's internationally recognised for educating and training graduates who have achieved local, national and international success. We also, have, we also are unique in that we offer the courses from levels four to level eight to degree level on the National Framework of Qualifications. So course areas include animation, animation and games degree, art and design, business and tourism, digital media. And you can see on your screen there, there's quite a range of courses under each of those. Make that you can view those courses and view details on those courses on our website, bcfe.ie. We also have courses in health, social care and childcare, education and training, music, media, te television, film and visual effects. So a range of cor courses there, over 46 courses to, to choose from. Now remember again, you can apply on our website, bcfe.ie, anytime during this open day on the upper right hand side of the page and places are limited. So get applying during today. Now I'd like to welcome the principal of, of um, BCFE, Cecilia Munro, to officially welcome you to this open day event today. 
Okay, good afternoon, Ken, and you're very welcome, everybody, to our virtual opening open day. And I hope you can get all the information you need for the different courses we offer here in Ballyfermot College. As Ken mentioned, I can confirm that Ballyfermot College is a national and international leader in new course development and is recognized all over the world, locally and, and regionally as well, for educating and training graduates who have achieved success. We are a very unique college in that we offer level four to level eight on the national framework of Irish uh, qualifications. So if you start here in Ballyfermot at a level four or a level five course, you can um, uh, complete that to an honours degree level. And this makes Ballyfermot College the first choice for many students. We have over 48 different courses and they will assist you in developing personal, social and cognitive skills in your chosen area. And you can use these qualifications to progress to further and higher education and onto employment. For example, you can continue to expand your transversal communication and digital skills by progressing within BCFE to complete a level six higher national diploma and eventually one of our degrees. If, however, you are unsure about attending higher education this year, I would advise you to defer your place, recoup from the stresses of our current pandemic and explore your course choice to see if it is the right one for you. And you can do that at Ballyfermot College. One of the key strengths of this college is that we have a very committed and professional staff who are industry trained and they will guide and support you through your educational journey with us. Our courses are dynamic, they're specialised and they're delivered in dedicated industry standard rooms with state of the art facilities and equipment. Uniquely for this college, a synergy exists between departments where expertise, resources and knowledge is shared to the maximum benefit of the students. When you become a student here, you are encouraged to be an active participant in your own learning and a strong emphasis is placed on having a successful college experience. However, I do recognize that your choice to study with us is a big investment in your future, but I can assure you that this college has a proven track record in producing graduates who excel in their field. Thank you, Ken. Thank you very much, Cecilia. So as Cecilia said, I mean, we are, let us shape your future and Ballyfermot College Further Education offers uh, from the courses from level four to level eight. And um, no CAO points are needed, uh, but the applicants must be over the age of 17. Now, applicants may be interviewed or be asked for a portfolio or, or audition. Our core courses are SUSE grants eligible. We have low course fees and there's exemptions to course fees available if, uh, for participants or applicants with medical cards Susie, our Back to Education Allowance holders. We have excellent links to university and ITs in Ireland, the UK, and especially the European Union. Advanced entry links to courses in colleges. And all of our programmes have excellent links to local industry, which was what we pride ourselves on with placements. And some courses lead directly to employment. So we are the choice for you for your courses. So again, places are limited. So if you want to apply on our website, BCFE. Uh, .ie on the upper right hand side and um, I think we're going to move on now and give you a flavour. Now let's look at a flavour of BCA, what we do, BCFE and what we do and how we can shape your future.
just look at the guidance area. Guidance counsellors have a very positive role to play in the college. Um, certainly uh, many of our students would come with issues and um, because of those issues they will need additional supports and as I said already we really want our students to succeed so whatever extra supports they need in terms of guidance and counselling then they will get from their designated counsellor. The guidance end of things very much involves progression routes and where students might go um, or want to go once they finish a course in the college. So they come into the college with a view to looking into their future already straight away and that's part of the role of guidance in the place. Um, and then the other role is very much a counselling role where we look after students and support students with personal difficulties or issues who may need a bit of extra support, a bit of planning um, and that type of thing that will, will help them to succeed. I suppose we're very keen on making sure that our students have any help they need to succeed. Guidance and counselling has grown and become, um, I suppose, more in demand lately particularly I mean we hear all the time about mental health issues and young people's mental health issues and how they struggle so I suppose part of what we do is fill a role that will support them with mental health issues as well and that frees them up and allows them to engage in the classroom that they might not ordinarily be able to engage with so it's a very very important role. A lot of our students come with challenges and that though we want to fill that gap and support them to overcome those challenges and many students will come and do a QQ level 5 and succeed and for them that has been a huge challenge and a huge success and we need to acknowledge that and be mindful of that. A lot of our guidance supports are available on the website bcfe.ie so if you log in and go to student information and guidance counselling services. Um, all of our courses are SUSE grant eligible and you can apply, you can apply for at suzy.ie or, or, or look to your social to your local social welfare office for uh, supports on courses as well. Now, obviously, attendance is very important at, in terms of receiving a SUSE grant. Um, so I'm just going to introduce you to Jacqueline, um, and Jacqueline is going to talk about the student supports. Good afternoon, Ken. How are you? I am. I'm fine. How are you? I'm good, thank you very much. And good afternoon, everybody. And thank you very much for staying on for this final section of a fabulous open day. And I hope you enjoyed looking and listening and hearing all about those courses, uh, the amazing amount of courses on offer in BCFE. Um, I'm here quite a while in this college and I'm never, uh, it never fails to amaze me the amount of beautiful, fabulous courses, very innovative courses and the amount of amazing work that the students have produced. And that could be you when you're here for the next academic year, hopefully. Um, I will just talk very briefly about the type of supports in the college. Uh, first of all, we are, as, as well as delivering really amazing, excellent and, and uh, innovative courses, we are known for our care of the student. And I think it's such an important part of what we do here in the college uh, for all of our students. Um, it, it's really a great stepping stone for all students who leave from or come from maybe their leaving cert, who have left education, come back to education or come from other colleges uh, or from the world of work. Uh, and because I don't think it has been mentioned a couple of times in the various courses, the class numbers are small and uh, not too small, but they're small enough so that you do get a huge amount of care. And that is so, so important this day and age. And we are very proud of our care support system. Uh, you just you have just seen Orlin Green, one of our guidance counsellors, uh, who explained a little bit about what counselling or the guidance counselling section is about. Uh, that is definitely one of our main areas, but I will go through the other areas as well, uh, just very briefly now. Um, I suppose on a day to day basis, very important to know there's a lot of care for all students on many levels here in the college while you will be here in college. Uh, so many people are looking out for you, starting with your course coordinator, your teaching team, all staff in the college, including the admin staff, the maintenance staff, the management staff. So basically every day there's care for the students. So no student goes unhelped at some stage. And that is so important to know. And it's a really, really big thing of mine that that, that is there. And of all of us, all in management, uh, we are very strong on student care. Uh, in relation to the structured care supports, uh, there are about five categories. I'm very quickly go through those and I'll tell you where you can get that information as well on the website. Uh, as Ola said, the first section, the first area will be guidance counselling. Uh, there are four guidance counsellors employed here in the college. 
Um, and they do both. They do guidance, which would be career guidance, but they also do quite a substantial amount of counselling. Um, each course has a guidance counsellor allocated to it. So no course is left unattended by a guidance counsellor throughout the time that the students are here in the college. Uh, those details and the names of the guidance counsellors and contact details will, are on our website. And again, I'll tell you where that is in, at the end of, of uh, the, the support section. The next area that is very, very important for an awful lot of our students is the disability support uh, section. Um, we have our disability support officer, Ony Nally, who works for the National Learning Network, and she attends the college here one day a week, so it's every Thursday. And Ony engages with students all week, but she just is physically here in the college on a Thursday, as she is in other colleges throughout the rest of the week. Um, disability support services are for a cohort of students, um, maybe not yourselves, but they are for anybody who's here at the minute, but they are a very, very important support service for a huge cohort of our students. And these would be students with high uh, learning needs, um, with some maybe uh, uh, disability that they need assistance with, uh, with some documented learning difficulties, such as serious dyslexia, dyscalculia, dyslexia, and so on. So that those supports are in place there for those cohort, that cohort of students. Very important when you apply and if you have any of uh, the higher need support, so really any need for support at all during your time here, uh, that you do let us know in your application form. That is so, so important because those supports then can, can be put in place from the beginning of September when you start the course here. And that is so important for you to know that it will be on your application form. Um, but, so that is the, the second type of support. Uh, for that support, you would need to have your documentation. So if you had supports in school, for example, and you had some documentation to show that you had a particular learning difficulty, that documentation is needed here as well. Um, the next uh, set of supports in relation to what we provide here in the college is for all students, and that is our academic support section. Uh, that was set up a long time ago, really for our level four and level five courses, but it rapidly, rapidly grew in need to all levels of courses. So now it stretches right into the degree area. Uh, we have academic support from funded students, which would be from the disability side, uh, the support side of things, and also for the non-funded students. So for every single student in college, uh, they can avail of academic support. Um, we will find, we find that the academic support is calm at the beginning. It doesn't really ramp up until about Christmas time. Uh, when all of the assignments start to come, you know, to start and students start to, you know, maybe get a little bit uh, top heavy with work and they need some help with their academic writing or their managing of the assignment levels or even their time, time management. So that's what the academic support is for. We have a number of our, our staff who are allocated to that support and it's really, really invaluable. Uh, at this stage of the year, which is March, uh, we are very much inundated with requests for academic support and we do provide that to all students. Um, the next set of supports, the second last set of supports I'll talk about is what is called a student support fund. That is the financial side of our supports that we can provide here in BCFE. Uh, again, that's running quite a while in the college and it is a really, really valuable service to students who need a small amount of financial support while they are here. Uh, it's paid on a weekly basis. There are certain criteria for that, for that support fund, but again, uh, I'll, I'll let you know where you get that information in, in, a, little while, in a few minutes. Um, but it's open to everybody at any level, of course, uh, in the college. Uh, it helps students. I've been told it helps students to stay on courses. It helps students just to really feel less stressed about being, being a student. It helps students to put down their working life, uh, their working hours, rather, uh, or just to basically focus on the course and have some money uh, to help them get through each week. Uh, it can be for food, it can be for clothing, it can be for bus fare. Uh, it, it's, it's whatever the student themselves want to do with that small amount of money per week. Uh, so that's our student support fund. And lastly, in relation to supports, we have, um, in the last couple of years, I suppose, through COVID, we have uh, been given a, a huge allocation of, of student laptops, a large allocation of student laptops, and that is still available and will be available going forward. So we have a student laptop loan scheme. And again, we might presume that every student has a, a means of, of doing the work, um, but that is not the case. And, and our student laptops uh, loan scheme is fully subscribed to, uh, and we've got more laptops in this year, and that they are again fully subscribed, so they are fully given out to students. So that is available as well to all students, and it's really, really very valuable. And 
you know, a comment was made by one student about a laptop who was really surprised to get a loan of a laptop for the year, said that it really made him feel he belonged in the college. He was being given this piece of equipment to do his work. Uh, he was able to avail it because I know he availed of academic support and, and other supports as well. So it, it all goes to make the student experience a better experience for, the, for you when you are here in the college. Now, there was a lot of information there and I'm sure it's hard to take it all in. If you need to look at this in detail, if you go to our website, the bcfe.ie website, www.bcfe.ie, uh, if you look under the, I think it's the, the tab on the right hand side, it's student information. In that student information, there are quite a number of articles there that you can have a look at in relation to supports, but one in particular is very important, it's under student supports, and it is our student support poster. On that poster, you will see all of what I've just spoken about here, the contact details for our guidance counsellors, for our disability support officer, for applying for the academic support, and for applying for the student support fund. So those four, four main supports. The laptop loan scheme is, is literally a form that when you come to the college, you'll be told about that and, and be given the chance to apply for a loan of a laptop. So if you have any queries, again, the, all of the email addresses are there. If you're in doubt at all, if you email info at bcfe.cbe.ie, uh, I, can, I can get that email, I can answer it for you individually, or it can be answered straight away from the admin office. So please do look into that if you're interested in coming here and hopefully we'll see you here in the college. And if you need any support at all while you are here for the normal day-to-day -day support. Thank you. Thank you, Jacqueline. Thanks, Thank Ken. You. And to apply for our courses, um, uh, it's just the three steps really. You apply on our website, bcfe.ie. Uh, you choose your preferred course, submitting details like PPS number and date of birth. Secure your place by, by uh, an acceptance fee of 40 euro. Complete the registration process with more details. And courses will commence in September 2022. And we'll be in contact with you for, for interviews and other things to, to finalize your place. Uh, I'd like you to consider following us on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and the website, and applying at our website, bcfe.ie. Thanks to all participants and potential new learners for joining us today. We have with more than 50 courses from level four to level eight, uh, we have a course for you. Kickstart your career and let us shape your future. The best way to predict your future is to create it. And BSF, BCFB's range of courses can assist you with this. We look forward to seeing you in September, 2022. And remember, students can apply now on our website, bcfe.ie, upper right hand side, and places are limited. Thank you very much for joining us this evening.